morning bloggy. It is another beautiful day. Beautiful! It actually is gorgeous today. It's been kind of raining all of last week and been kind of like foggy-ish, but today is just beautiful. It's so true. Um, anyway, so my agenda for the day is I am going to go to school and I'm gonna go to my classes and then I finish at 3.20 and so does Johnny McEaster. So then we're gonna both go to, we're probably gonna go eat somewhere and then we're gonna go to the beach for Emma's birthday. Happy birthday, Em. I love you. But yeah, it is gonna be so fun because today is gonna be in the high 70s or maybe even the low 80s so it'll be perfect for the beach and then after that this is really really exciting slash kind of nerve-wracking but I'm gonna be playing my first soccer game ever and not just like backyard soccer at the park like an, an official game like playing against another team so I've never played before but I will be playing tonight so hopefully that uh hopefully that goes well um I'm 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 excited. I, I would say I'm like 60% excited, 40% nervous. Yeah, that's probably the <laughs> statisticals of my emotions right now. But yeah, I'm, it's, it's gonna be challenging. It's gonna push me out of my comfort zone, but I think it's gonna be really good for me. So, three, killing three stones with one, or, killing three, killing, killing two, killing, killing one, killing, I'm saying three. Three birds with one with one stone. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Why is that even a saying though? It seems so morbid. Like, why do you want to kill birds with stones? I don't know. But anyways, I'm really excited. Mumsy, do you have anything to say to the vlog? Beautiful day. This is Mumsy's green tea contained in a red Contigo. Do you guys? Okay, Contigo is one of my favorite brands because it keeps it keeps your your drinks so hot like for a long period of time and it doesn't leak and it even has a fancy schmancy locker mechanism so if you want to lock it you just go boom and then when you press this it, it won't open and then unlock it boom and then you can press it and drink your tea anyways I love the Contigo the Contigo brand it's a good one Contigo? yeah Contigo but anyways, um, I guess that's about Dude. the banjo in this song is supreme. Anyways, but yeah, I'm excited for today. Hopefully I'll get some footage of me playing soccer for the first time because it's kind of a memory that I want to document. And so yeah, with that, oh, I'll probably get some clips from the beach too because I'm going with some really awesome friends, so that'll be fun too. I don't know, I'm excited for today. Oh, but here's something I have to mention. Hold on, this music's a little bit loud. Um, but here's something that I have to mention. Tomorrow in Toastmasters, which is what I mentioned before, it's like a public speaking enhancing club, I have to give a speech. And there's different kinds of speeches you can give, but tomorrow I'm giving speech with visual aids. And pretty much you're supposed to practice like the week before, you know, practice a lot. I have not practiced at all. And so all day today I'm gonna be gone and then I have to leave tomorrow morning at 6.30 in the AM to get to Toastmasters, so I really don't know. This might have to just be an off-the-cuff speech, but those are those can be exciting because you kind of just say whatever comes to your brain and sometimes, sometimes it's a good thing and sometimes it's a very, very bad thing, so <laughs> we'll see how it goes. So with that, over and out. Hello there, bloggy. So, abs get, why is it so fuzzily? Hmm, oh well, I guess it'll just be fuzzily. So Abskin and I just got out of fundamentals of nutrition class and we got our exam back. The, um, it was on chapter four and five, carbs, carbohydrates lipids. and lipids. And Abigail. Oh, so fuzzily, okay. I, is it still fuzzily? Quite, quite. Oh man. Abigail got a 100%. Ooh. And her last test, she got a what, 102 percent? Yes. Yeah. It was. It was. It's, I love taking tests in this class because, with fundamentals and nutrition, not only do you learn so much that's so applicable in life, but you also get to take 
I don't know. I just really enjoy the exams in that test. I don't. I literally look forward to taking the exams, which is weird. It kind of makes me sound a little bit nerdy, but <laughs> it's so true. Anyways, um, yeah. So now we're just walking to the lunch tables, and a lot of people are staring at me. So I'm gonna put you away. Okay, over and out. Hello, bloggy. So I'm just gonna vlog this moment because. I never vlog at lunchtime, so here's Abigail looking uh, swankity so swank <laughs> and John Zita looking swell and D Vster looking looking f fine <laughs> and Sarah I'm looking the gorgeous. Wow, it's really hard to come up with adjectives. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, it's lunchtime and I just ate a banana. You know, Abigail taught me the best way to eat a banana instead of peeling it from, you know how like bananas have the little stem? Instead of peeling it from the stem, you peel it from the bottom and that way you have a handle when you eat your banana. It's really, it's actually, it's really awesome. I'm so glad you taught me that. But yeah. I'm honored to be the one. You learn a lot. Yeah, you actually do. I've learned a lot of, a lot of tips off of Pinterest. Anyways. <laughs> Over and out. Hello there, vloggy. So, we are at the beach for MZ's birthday. Here she is. And I wanted to pull out my camera because would you look at this? The sunset is so gorgeous. What you doing, Ems? Putting my guitar away. Oh, okay. Dude, what were the birds all doing here? They were like... What were they after? Trying to eat our food. And they actually like grabbed that plastic bag over there. Oh, the my... Only sunscreen in it. <laughs> they thought that was amusing. Oh, my goodness. But yeah, no, I just wanted to pull out the camera just to document this beauty right here. And we're over here at these volleyball courts. I don't know if you can see any of my peeps, but we're all playing volleyball. In fact, I kind of ditched my team, so I should probably get over there. I don't know if you guys can see. Okay, the camera is not doing it justice, but it is just so stinking beautiful. <laughs> Ever happens. Hey guys, guess what? Sunsets every night. Get used to it. <laughs> <laughs> Lucas. Lucas, what did you say? <laughs> Hello bloggy. there, bloggy. So we are at the soccer game. I got these cleats yesterday at the thrift store for two dollars and ninety-five cents. Woo! We are getting ready to get onto the field. Here's our goalies. Tonight or How are you feeling about this game? Dropped, uh, I'm feeling jacket. How are you vibes. feeling about this, Steve Easter? I'm feeling pumped. I'm ready to go. Yeah? yeah. Good, good, good. Good, good. <laughs> I'm excited about this. Ooh, okay, uh, over and out. All right, Bloggy. So here we are at Juliana's first soccer game. She's not quite out on the field yet. She's over there rooting on her team. Over and out. This is Juliana coming in for her debut play. Okay, Bloggy. So I decided to move to the other side so you could have a clear view. Juliana's coming back in from her first time out. I'm like glued to that girl. That's good. Real? Oh. Uh, Juliana, how was your first time out? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Exhilarating. 